What's up people, Manor here, coming to you with an unboxing video. This time we are going to be looking at an easy, economical and green product that allows you to save the environment and also have a healthy lifestyle. This is not a sponsored video. The product that I bought, I bought myself. I'm going to be using a Stanley knife that I got from Home Depot. Again, not sponsored, but love these gadgets. Let's open it up and always uh, make sure to open it away from yourself. And the item in review is a pure water filter. The key feature are it's a pitcher, 11 cup capacity, uh, filter has two months life, uh, reduces 14 contaminants and removes 99% of the lead. This is a UPC barcode and it has a 90 days limited warranty. Let's open it up. Right off the back, nicely packaged. This is the pitcher. Tape 12. Again, I'm going to use a utility knife away from yourself. Wow, very nicely packaged. And it has uh, the gauge button, uh, how to reset it. Okay to drink, replace soon and replace now. Three LED indicators, easy fill option thing. Okay, this is new as compared to the older model. The spout is covered, so the water is not going to get contaminated or dust is not going to come in. The only complaint that I have is the battery fixture that's in here. It cannot be replaced. So once the battery dies, you have to buy a new filter. This is the inside of the reservoir to clamp things, I guess. And I'm going to be washing them. The reservoir is pretty small. I think you need to fill it up twice for it to filter it through. Inside is also covered. It has a pitcher manual. Reducing lead is worth it. it. Takes 20 minutes to filter. My God, that's going to take a long time. But I guess it's worth it. Simple install instructions. Again, the sensor instruction. And it has a coupon also for $2 off. So I guess they want you to be a returning customer. And this is the actual filter. And it's sealed. And it's sealed, and no air is escaping from it. Just gonna take this, open it up. Safety is number one priority, so make sure to do very carefully. Okay, this is new. They normally do not do this. It says remove and soak the filter before use. Uh, gray particles inside are normal. So initially, the first time, I guess, the first time you soak, you have to toss out uh, the first time pitch thingy. Okay, pretty lightweight filter right off the bat. And it has some white residue. So I'm going to wash it first, then I'm going to put it inside and let it soak. All right, they want you to soak this entire thing under water. So I'm just going to put this back in here and just cover it up. That way it actually does soak completely. And we will see you in 15 minutes. I did wash with warm uh, water and a little bit of uh, dish soap, all the inside uh, containers. Uh, basically, I washed everything that actually will come in touch with the water. Now we're going to be assembling the... Uh, filter you drop it from the top and then you rotate basically it will go in and it will connect into the groove right here and you have to snap it and yeah you have to tighten it a little bit uh, the opening this opening will be going into the pitcher and it's going to be near the water sp uh, fountain thingy so it's going to go right here once that's done we're going to take the cover again this pointing item up and we're going to just drop it over here. Once it's dropped, I'm going to fill it and we will see how long it takes to filter. All right, the first filtration is done. And as I expected before, uh, the top reservoir only fills the pitcher halfway. So you have to refill the pitcher twice in order to filter it. Uh, the first time filtration is done, I'm going to toss this water out. I'm going to refill it. Total amount of time it took was about 15 minutes. Uh, 
to pay, uh, to filter half of it while it's a lot long or uh, as while it's a longer as compared to the other uh, pure water filter that I have the benefit is this one is taking out the lead so I'm going to toss this water out I'm going to refill it and then comes the taste test and the product dimensions are side to side it's about 11 inches from this side to that side uh, height wise it's also about 11 inches and as far as the width uh, I'll say it's about 5 inches so pretty decent side filter and again the top portion initially only fills half of it so you have to filter it twice the total amount of time it takes is about 15 minutes and now we're going to be doing the taste test I like this feature that it actually automatically closes from the top mm, pretty delicious it doesn't has a metallic taste or anything like that it just tastes clear like crystal clear like water basically definitely a big thumbs up for me as always like comment subscribe and i will see you guys and girls on the next one later people and don't forget to thumbs up